Good morning, world. Good morning. <laughs> Looks like somebody had a good night's sleep. He doesn't wake up much anymore during the night, so he sleeps on or the whole night now, which is really nice. Get more extra sleep. I got a good night's sleep too. I went to bed and I feel like a very old lady for saying this. But I went to bed at 8 o'clock because I was really, really tired. I was watching a show and I was falling asleep. Say good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm fabulous. You don't want to say hi to Molly? Say good morning, Molly. Say good morning. We're having French toast for breakfast. I'm kind of excited because for some really odd reason, when I woke up in the middle of the night, all I wanted was French toast. And the funny thing is, that was what I was planning on making this morning anyway because we ran out of pancake mix. I woke up at about 12.25. Back up. And um, I couldn't get back to sleep. And I was just really hungry. All I wanted was some French toast. And then I got really thirsty because I was thinking about French toast. Is that weird? <laughs> and, I, and I completely forgot to bring a water bottle up with me, so I stole his water. I had like that much left. <laughs> but it was just enough to quench my thirst last night when I woke up to go to the bathroom. <laughs> Were you wondering what happened to your water? For a second, I was like, wait, what the hell? I just went, ah, whatever, drink the rest of the water, and went, ah, I'm not thirsty anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Molly. So big. I remember when you were, like, super duper tiny. Well, this is a book about all the stuff in the town. Legendary locals of Coventry. Something my mom bought. And the first time I looked at it, well... One of the cleaners, I used to take all my suits and stuff to when I was in high school. Yes, I had to wear suits. What are you, what are you doing? He's <laughs> being silly. I'm, 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 I'm giving you some information, educational. But the cleaners was opened in 1946. And the one in Sound Street opened in 1965. So the place has been around for a long time. Now you're just like, I'm... And that has been your fun educational fact of the day. Now suck it all up. <laughs> suck it in the knowledge. Look at these dancing. Time for another edition of... Story time while cooking. We're gonna put it on the refrigerator so I don't forget the name. <laughs> Not really a story as much as an informational thought today, but it'll, it'll play out like a story because it happened while we were outside walking. As you know, we went down to the supermarket down the street to get some cheese for the wonderful hamburgers, which are right back from the walk. Got the cheese just about home. And I exclaim with great vigor that I'm warm. I take my sweater or beanie off. I don't know if you can see her back there. I Probably not. Well, she goes, Are you crazy? It's cold out here. And I'm like, no, I'm warm. And that's how my life has been. A quick little walk down the street and back. I get warm to the point where in third, I said it was what, 45? Uh, I don't remember. It's between 43, 45 degrees when we walk down there. I already got way too warm <laughs> walking down there and back and then probably the the entire trip back down and back was like maybe a quarter mile in that type of weather normal people do not get to the point where it's like oh I got to again this was a walk not a jog not a run not a, a power walk even we were just walking you know walking down the street Going to the supermarket to buy some cheats. Just like that. <laughs> Couldn't even make it to the house without having to take my sweater off. And my beanie too. It was getting warm. I grew my hair out so it gets a, gets a little warm up top here. 
And then again, most of your heat comes out of there anyway, so it, it makes sense. That's how I've always been. And uh, I don't, I'm trying to remember whether or not I said it in a past video, but when she was pregnant, it was great. Because she was always warm, always hot. We, we had the window open. And you know, everything, excuse me, must flip the burgers. Depending on the woman, it might be a little bit of a difference from what you're used to. Like in my case, first time she said, it's getting way too hot in here. And I'm going, you're usually like, it's freezing. Sorry for the interruption. That's my dance. You know, it, it just boggled my mind that I'm getting warm. I'm just hot. We need to open a window. It confused me. <laughs> That's how I always am. And it sucks so much. Summer sucks. So bad, I gotta make up a new word for it. It sucks so bad. I don't know what you're talking about. This summer wasn't even that hot. <sighs> and that's what I was used to pre pregnancy. And why I loved it during pregnancy. <laughs> I know. This summer was not that hot. For her. Chicago gets a lot hotter. Oh, well, Rhode Island got up to 90s two summers ago for yeah, 14 it, days it, consecutively. Yeah, but that was two summers ago. I, 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 I don't think I was here. Did I get two summers ago? No. That was the summer before you got here. Yeah, it didn't even get that high. It barely got to 90s this summer. Which was nice. Exactly. But I still walking around doing any sort of physical work. No, I needed an AC around me or I would have. Every shirt I had, I'd come home and I had to take a shower or jump in the pool because I couldn't cool down. I can't cool down during the summer. It's almost impossible unless I'm sitting in a freezer. That's why I love going outside so much during the winter because it's nice and cool. I can run around and be merry and jolly and have fun. Don't get me wrong, I have fun during the summer. It's just mostly in the car. <laughs> or, in or inside. The just how I am. I wish it would change. Unfortunately, it, it won't. Mm -mm. That'll, be, mm -mm. that'll be me for the rest mm -mm. of my life. Always warm, always sweating. Like right now, I'm cooking. She's got a sweater on. I'm in a t-shirt and I wish I could take it off, but I'm on video, so. I'm cold. But that's why we're so perfect for each other, because I can warm her up and she can cool me down. And that was another story time while making dinner. Catch you later.